Hey everyone, Ezor here, and in this video I'll be showing you how to get the collectibles for the second half of the Knights campaign for the game For Honor. Now, again, with this one, I did have half of these already collected, so I will be showing you where they're all going to be, and I'll just kind of explain a little bit where they are, since they don't always appear to be the most obvious places. So this is going to be 1.4, right off the bat, it's going to be on the left there, and then there's going to be one right, right across the way to the right. After that you do go forward a little bit and you'll end up finding one before you get on the bridge and this is going to be kind of on the right path more from the statue it'll just be an abandoned shack here so now this is going to keep going until after the bridge is shot down by the catapults when that happens you'll fight this guy real quick here and then you'll see there's a war horn you just got to check that out and then right below that is going to be a breakable so make sure you get both of those before continuing on with horns and drums and signal fires. We were never going to slip into Valkenheim unnoticed. That is why I chose to enter through the front door. Now you're just going to run across the stream there. There's going to be one right here that's just the giant head. And then from there, just go up to the top of the little platform. Once you kill everybody, there will be breakables up here as well. Now this next part here, uh, you do fight a guy one-on-one, -on -one, you get knocked off the edge. I actually ended up dying, so I respawned at a different point. So this is just going to be continuing on. You will end up finding it as a abandoned ship here. And if you look up, you'll see a platform, and that's going to be the observable. And with these, we would make this, this is going to be the last section here when you're actually assaulting the bridge itself. The rest of the collectibles are here. There's going to be the actual gate itself, there's going to be a catapult that you can check out on the right hand side of where you enter, and then you can also look at Palia, and that's going to be uh, the ninth one. The last one here will be actually when you're going up the bridge. Once you get towards the end there, you'll have to look off to the left there and just stare at the statue, there'll be one of the observables. So that's going to be about it for chapter 1.4. The ancient kings of the Vikings were mighty. Now we'll go into the next one, the peacekeeping one. This one is kind of annoying. Um, there's going to be a silent part here too. I don't know why my footage ended up snapping on me, but it uh, it was kind of annoying for a section here, so there will be no sound at all, but just kind of pay attention to where it is. So once you start off, you keep going forward here. You just double check the statue. There will be a couple of guys here. And then right past that is going to be this dead scout. Now you're going to keep going until you get to the end here. You'll see uh, this is where it actually starts being muted, so I apologize again. But you check out the boat and then also the hanging soldier. And then directly to the left of that you can actually see the um, next observable. But I run down here and grab this one. There's going to be three right in a row here. So just make sure to grab all three of them. And if you keep going, if you go, you end up running behind the ship there, there's going to be the first breakable for this section. So make sure you grab that before you go up the ladder. And once you go up the ladder, you're going to keep going just pretty much the only way you really can. Uh, this is on the way up, I guess you could say. You have to see these in order to keep going. So the problem with this one, I noticed, is that there is a lot of different routes you can take. So I this is the only route that I took that I was able to find everything. I don't know if there's other routes to take around it. So... Just kind of watch for that. Um, if you're missing one, you're here or there. There were two barbarians here at this tree. If you keep going up, you see there's the observable. And then I actually end up backtracking and going another way. Um, there's a little path here that will take you to a door that's an observable, so make sure to grab that one real quick. Now, I would recommend going back to the main pathway and then continuing on from there, or going back to the pathway I was just on. Because if you do what I do here and run forward uh, and c gather this breakable, there's five guys here. So just be careful with that. They kind of they kind of kick my butt. So once you keep going, though, you will end up finding this little bonfire with another breakable set. Once you actually enter into the Viking base, I guess, uh, you have to seal the door. And once you do that, right above it is where that observable is. Behind that's the breakable, and then you keep going until you end up going into where the elevator shafts are. That's where the last of the items are going to be. So, 
I should pull that one, I think. Their machinery was far beyond what I had expected to find. Since the last time I'd been through, they had uncovered a new source of lore. Or perhaps just a very... The machinery was well made, but I had a job to do. Alright. 1.6. This is going to be the last part of the Knights chapter. This one, I would highly recommend right off the bat you start sieging with a ram. I would make it so the ram goes all the way to the end there, and if you look on the upper left, my icon is to release the ram. I would recommend doing that just because I did end up having the ram be destroyed when I was running around getting the collectibles the first time. So this is going to be on the right of where the ram has to go down. There's going to be two observables on this side. Then there's going to be a breakable right next to the second one here. Next look up above the ram, that's going to be where it's, that one's going to be. And then if you run over to where the uh, Vikings keep spawning from, there will be one there. And then the ram itself as well. That within a day, Viking ships would fill the harbor and their army would destroy us. But I intended to be long gone before that could happen. We dragged our ram's machinery across Falkenheim. So then after that, you climb to the top of it. You will fight one-on-one -on -one with the uh, Viking Warden. Then you look behind you when you come through, and that's going to be one where the door was. You end up taking a left from where you start. There's going to be one here. And then directly behind it, if you look at uh, the Warden, you'll end up finding her just... She, it's a little tricky to actually see it. I was able to get yeah, there. I saw it for a little bit, and then it disappeared. So just make sure you grab that one, and then go up the stairs on the left-hand side here to get the breakable. After that, you'll keep going down. Um, don't jump off this little ramp here. Uh, just make sure to uh, get the observable. If you jump off, you'll get a cutscene, and then you have to pretty much start from... Start all over because you won't be able to get that. Otherwise, you could just run over this side and make sure to get it before you do that. But again, if you don't get this breakable or that observable before you fight him, you need to do the whole map over again. So once you fight him and you get him to run away, you'll end up coming through here. On the right-hand side is a breakable. And then if you keep going, you'll end up finding the last observable. And right past it is going to be the last breakable. That's all there is for the Knights campaign. If you... Had any trouble with any of them, finding any of them, or if I explained it funny, just leave a comment and I'll try to explain it a little bit more in depth for you. If you like other video game related content, that's kind of what I do, so consider subscribing. Thank you all for watching. I've been Ezor, and until next time, keep your story going.